Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a deck review. Hey, today we're gonna look at the Chameleons playing cards from Aussie Wind and Laura Alexander. Well, this was originally designed to be the ultimate deck of cards and it's the first, it's actually the first release for a brand new uh, signature series that Expert put out a while ago. And so it was supposed to uh, improve performances and uh, just kind of make a better card all around. It was supposed to be the ultimate deck for magicians. Of course, they've done the signature series long since then, but this was the first one. This was the prototype that they used uh, to test both the synthetic tuck and the paper stock. This tuck case is all done in kind of like a deep red and silver foil. It says chameleons across the top, and then it has Aussie Wind's uh, logo there. It says playing cards underneath that. One side says expert signature series number one. The other side says expert playing card company, and the bottom has some ad copy about expert playing cards and Aussie Wind. The top simply says says classic finish and it has Aussie Wind's uh, logo there. And the back design, of course, is the back design of the cards. And then you have that beautiful, really thick tongue flap that I love uh, from these tucks. That is pretty much it for the tuck case. Let's take a look at these cards. These cards are printed from the Expert Playing Card Company and they are done on their classic stock. Now it's called classic stock because this feels most like what many card handlers are now used to. Very soft stock, very easy to handle, the deck is going to feel familiar. It's going to be, I think, superior to other standard decks. This classic stock ensures that these decks uh, don't even vary from deck to deck. They're also traditionally cut, which means they're perfect for pharaoh shuffling, which that would be a bottom-up uh, table shuffle. This deck should come in the Juan Tamari Mamonica stack, uh, which is great for magicians who know that stack already. Uh, they can open the deck, cut to the ace of spades, and they're good to go. The back design of the cards, you'll notice uh, that one of the experts' other claim to fames is a perfect registration. Now, what is registration? Registration is the cut so that when you look at the border, the border looks even from one card to the next. So the registration on these cards are perfect. They are beautiful. And the borders won't like shift back and forth. They won't flutter uh, when you riffle them. Just a beautiful, ornate back design, all done in a single color. Of course, you do have chameleons there in the corners, along with some all-seeing eyes and then Aussie Wind's logo in the center. With this deck, you'll also get two original jokers, and they are a chameleon sitting on a branch. There's a J in the corner for joker, and then underneath that, it says Expert Playing Card Company, New York, New York. Your Ace of Spades is very similar to the Zen Ace of Spades, although instead of being the Zen logo, it has Aussie Wind's logo there in the center. And then underneath that, it says Expert Playing Card Company, New York City. The pips and indice cards in this deck are chunky, uh, and I think the color is faded. I think it's supposed to look like a classic older deck and so that's why I think the ink color looks faded and then the pip sizes are a little bit uh, larger. The core cards also have a very classic, very vintage feel. Uh, they're gonna look like uh, older court cards uh, long before they were modernized. Uh, a lot of the images uh, are a bit bigger, a bit chunkier, a bit more uh, loosely drawn. Uh, so it really kind of fits the overarching theme of the deck. All right, so that's my review of the Chameleons playing cards from Aussie Wind, Laura Alexander, and the Expert Playing Card Company. As always, we ask that you like this video just so other people can find it faster. We also recommend that you subscribe to this channel just so that you can stay up to date on the latest in cards and card magic. If you wanna follow me on social media, you can. I'm at facebook.com slash magicorthodoxy, twitter.com slash magicorthodoxy, instagram.com slash magic underscore orthodoxy. And if you need more content, you can always find it at magicorthodoxy.com. Thanks, bye.